a music festival here, Fairport Conventions, Crop Ready uh, Annual Festival in uh, Oxfordshire. And I'm just looking at this uh, field through here. I can't go in because it's private property, it's uh, barbed wire. Um, but I've seen some beautiful old apple trees. Uh, I'm not quite sure how many there are over there. It almost looks like one big spreading tree, but I think it's two, possibly three trees. Very big, very spreading. Quite a lot of fruit on the outer canopy. Probably in need of some pruning, but uh, looking really wonderful. Maybe this was an old, this is the remnants of an old orchard. This was an orchard, perhaps. Most of the trees have been cut down. Just a few in the boundary were left for ornamental purposes. Um, underneath them, loads of nettles. Uh, Apples, I think possibly that one might be a pear. And there's a tree there, you can see it dead centre, which is dead. Uh, and this will happen, I don't know whether that's an apple or a pear or some other form of fruit tree, but it probably is a fruit tree. Um, one of the questions I'm most often asked is um, I've got an old orchard or an old tree, it's very old, what should I do with it? The best thing I recommend is go through it, anything that's obviously dead, remove it. If you've got a big tree like that, a big old tree with a big thick trunk and a wood turner or a maker of musical instruments, blown instruments like um, uh, whistles or wooden flutes, uh, fruit wood is the most sought after, uh, or it makes very good firewood. The trunk, try to see if you can find a way of putting that in the hand of somebody who can make use of it, but otherwise firewood. Um, I don't know if you can see, there's a big branch of, a, um, of the poplar that's fallen uh, onto it. But don't don't overdo the pruning, take away the rubbish underneath them, you can see there's a rubbish underneath that. Maybe crown lift the tree a little bit, that's uh, remove, let, to allow more air underneath, remove the lowest branches. Thin it out a little bit, don't overdo it, remove anything that's obviously dead. But if you're fortunate enough to uh, have responsibility for uh, a very old fruit tree, or even better still, several very old fruit trees, do respect them, do take care of them, they've been there a long time, they've seen lots of comings and goings. Um, they may be a variety that's on the verge of extinction and uh, there are lots of little wonderful uh, remnants of orchard tucked away throughout the English countryside, not just in Oxfordshire but many other places. If you're responsible for the care of some old apple, pear or plum trees then do take care of them, uh, they're precious.